Hi, I'm Chop Slambon and welcome to another edition of GVL TV. Proudly sponsored by Gagliardi Scott. Great people, great results. Tonight we're at uh, Deakin Reserve with the uh, Shep United Football Netball Club, joined by uh, club stalwart Lee Henney. How are you tonight, Lee? Yeah, good, thanks, Chop. Yeah. That's yeah. the way. Um, just a little bit about yourself. I know you've been at the club for a long time, done a lot of roles at the club. Yeah. Um, so we've, we've got about three hours, so let's... Uh, <laughs> no, no, we've yeah. got a couple of minutes here. How about um, tell us uh, some of those roles? Oh, well, I've been around the club since 1981. I think I've been a member, but um, it's only last 15 years or so I've got on board on the committee and, um, yeah, really got into helping out and doing things. And, yeah, so committee person, I do the cleaning here. Also look after the boys' jumpers, take them home, wash them, make sure they're ready for the next game and do the stats for the seniors. And, yeah, just um, very involved the, the seconds and the... Uh, senior team both teams okay yeah. um so on a, on a normal saturday you'd, you'd get here early and go home late sort of what's early and what's late yeah usually here by around eight yeah. o open up walk around the ground open up the toilets open up all the rooms and everything and um yeah have the rooms open make sure everything's ready to go um when the thirds come in yep yeah, i assist the team manager for the thirds if he needs a hand and, and that and same with the seconds and the seniors if they need a bit of a hand i help them out and if they're under pressure a bit under the pump and yeah, so yeah, I'm usually here till after the game, and I like to get up and have a few drinks for the boys after the game. And so it's a long, as well. yeah, social, and that's the best part. Yeah. So it's a long day, yeah, but yeah, yeah it's worth it. They haven't uh, talked uh, about getting you back playing again in the twos, obviously, <laughs> the numbers are short. No, no, that'll never happen. No, they haven't. Knees are gone now, they'll never stand up. Um, so we go back a little bit earlier in your life, career. Have you always been a Sheppard United person, or is it sort of, like you said, later in, in the last 10, 15 years? Last 20 years, yeah, but I've um, been involved with footy clubs. I was at St George's Road Primary School Footy Club for three okay. years. I coached there. And then I was involved in the Maguire, Maguire College team, the Maguire Tigers. I was there for five years on their committee. I've been president. I've been um, secretary, uh, assistant coach, runner, trainer. Yeah, wave the flags occasionally and yeah, yeah do a bit finished. of them. So about the last 20 years, Tuesdays and Thursday nights, uh, pretty well taken Bring care of. Um, but yeah, I, I'm sure the club uh, you know, certainly appreciate everything you do and, and, and the hours that you put in. Um, we're going to have a little fun with you. I want to relax right. now. Um, you're, you're a watcher of the show, aren't you? Uh, not really. I've, because <laughs> it's all, because show, you're so no. busy, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, so, so, yeah, yeah okay. busy, busy, busy. You will be from now on. Uh, oh, yeah, absolutely, yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. I'll right. have to watch this one anyway. Absolutely. Okay, so we've got the fast 10. So we asked you um, 10 questions pretty quickly. Okay. And um, this is where uh, you get to pay out on a few of your club friends, maybe. All oh, right, great. So here we go. <laughs> yeah. they haven't got, they, they've got the right to reply. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we're going to start off uh, pretty slow. Okay, who's the biggest pretty boy in the team? That'd be Harrison Osborne. Who goes overboard with the strapping each week? Harrison is another one that gets pretty strapped up and, uh, yeah. And who secretly loves uh, Married at First Sight or The Bachelor? Gina, yeah, one of our trainers, she's in all that kind of shows. I've been on Facebook, who's doing what on those shows. And, <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I wouldn't have a clue. What about the biggest softie in the club? Shane Neves. What about the sorest loser? Definitely Harrison Osborne. I, he was injured on the weekend, sat up in the box with me and well, I was doing stats and yes, he's uh, very uncomfortable up there. Oh, okay. and, <laughs> Who exaggerates the story the most? Bloke that comes to footy, um, Frank McCluskey, who likes to tell stories and jokes and everything. He has everybody in stitches and that, but he's uh, very good to listen to, yes. Good work. Who has the worst white line fever? Maybe Jack Norman. He gets out there, he's a little terrier, you know, you can't <laughs> get away from him. He's yes. always tackling people and throwing them to the ground, yeah. What about the worst tattoo? Jazz Turner, in the, who plays mainly in the reserve. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, he's got a lot of tattoos, so yeah, 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 covered yeah, in that. Yeah. Who wants to go, or who should go on um, a farm once a wife next year? Oh, uh, that's probably Mark At Athenitis. All right, well, that's it. That's over and uh, easy. Wasn't that hard? Yeah, it was quite easy. Yeah, thanks, Excellent. Yep. All right, no, look, thanks for um, joining us on, on GVL TV. Yep. Um, like I said, keep up the great work that you do. Um, I know the Shep United people and, uh, you know, been a stalwart and the hours that you put in are incredible. So thanks for joining us tonight, and um, we'll see you uh, around the track. Thank you, Chop. Thank you. Cheers. Thanks for joining us on GVL TV. If you've got a story from Clubland, please send it to a GVL TV show at gmail.com. Just send it in and we'll follow it, follow it through with you.